ba 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 all right, here we are at Tosco's Brick Oven Pizza with their all-you-can-eat uh, pasta night on Monday nights. I'm here, luckily, with Josh. He set this all up. Josh is from the Goat Food Challenges. Please check out his channel. I'll link him in the description below. So basically, we get one bowl at a time. You pick from different pastas, different sauces. I'll throw all the stuff up where we're picking from. We're starting with angel hair. What sauce is this? Marinara. Angel hair marinara. So my first one weighed... 2113 so it's a lot of weight but this bowl is heavy and we'll have to subtract it out afterwards so we'll tell you what this actually weighed uh, once we get going here we go all right let's start this is a serious bowl of pasta to start out with you can see why they didn't want to give me five and they don't go small it's really? the same size every time it's very good yes this this marinara sauce is excellent It's all homemade. You can tell this is homemade. It's absolutely. $8.99 for all this food. This is, can't wait to see what this bowl weighs. When Josh told me about Tosco's $9 all you can eat pasta and their fresh homemade sauces, I said, let's definitely film there. That first bowl was awesome. Very good. I can see the problem today I'm going to have those the sauce. They give you so much sauce and they don't want to not eat something. Mm -hmm. That was 1,251 grams. So we had the second plate, it's angel hair with a rose. Rosa. Rosa sauce. It's like a vodka sauce. And this this looks smaller to me. Like it might, if I want to, I'm going to guess this is smaller. It feels lighter. Yes. I'm, I'm 1706. Five, one. All right, bowl two. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna try Ooh. to not. Ooh, that is hot. It took about 15 minutes to get our second plate of pasta, and you can see it is still steaming hot. I asked if I could start with five bowls right from the get-go, but they said I had to order them one at a time. This is good. It wouldn't be my first choice, but it is a good, good change. I found out about Josh a couple of months ago. Turns out he lives kind of in my area. He's been doing eating challenges for about a year and our schedule's finally connected where we could sit down and eat together and get to know each other a little bit more. Third bowl, this is angel hair again with bolognese. Yes, angel and hair with bolognese. This is my, hopefully my favorite one because I love the meat sauce. I'm starting with 21 in 2018. Um, again, before I took out the, the bowl. We started eating this video at 4.30 and we closed the restaurant at 8 p.m. So we filmed a lot of footage and I just had problems with my cameras left and right, batteries dying, memory cards filling up. It just took a, a while to get a refill every time. So I apologize for some of these cuts back and forth with the cameras, but I will say the food was definitely worth waiting for. This is our fourth, fourth bowl, fourth different sauce, all angel hair. This is Alfredo sauce. Alfredo. This is a, a smaller plate. It's still like, um, I'm going to say it's probably about 800 grams. Why don't you subtract it out? We'll see. This bowl of pasta was one of the quicker ones to eat. The sauce just stuck to the noodles, so when you picked up the noodles, all the sauce came with it. You didn't have to scrape afterwards. And it was very uh, tasty sauce for sure. So this bowl of five, last of the sauces, angel hair with tomato sauce. Just tomato sauce. You want to find out how that's different than marinara? <laughs> yes. It looks not as thick, maybe. I don't know. At the start of this meal, Josh told me his capacity is a roughly eight to 10 pound capacity, which is a fairly good capacity, but he hasn't been slowing down so far. And I know he's gotta be pushing at least over nine pounds right now. So I'm very impressed how he's, he's keeping the pace so far. I know Josh is 
right about 11 pounds right now and every forkful he eats is more than he's ever eaten before in his life. So I tease him a little bit by telling him to finish this bowl of pasta so we can get a bowl of penny bites. Anything else for you guys? When you're at your real capacity, it is so hard to eat anything, so I want to put up a timer just to show you how long it took him to eat these last couple forkfuls. Josh is pretty much at his capacity. He's really struggling a little bit, but I'm proud that he's pushing through and finishing our strong. Look at this. We have a new max. It's not every day you get a new max. Look at him licking that plate clean to make sure he gets every bit of it. That's better. 831. Mm. That is Josh's new capacity. Let's add this up and see what he ate. 4,980 grams of pounds. Oh my goodness. 10.979 pounds. That is a new record. Very nice. That's almost 11 pounds. Yep. Oh. I knew. I knew you were over 10. I was like, wow. you had to be. Good job. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's basically 11 pounds. New record for me, for sure. Yeah. Oh, I'm feeling it, though. I'll give you that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last plate. This is 18, 12, and 4. Stretch it out. Angel hair with marinara. It definitely is a good last one. I normally spend about 60 minutes filming an all-you-can-eat video. Uh, this video went three and a half hours, so I would have hoped to have done at least 10 kilograms of food or 22 pounds. Pasta is very simple food to get a big number on because you don't have to drink while you're eating it. But this last refill took 30 minutes, so no big numbers tonight, but the food was delicious. Yeah, it's a battery in the middle. Okay, so the battery's dying, so Josh did five for a personal best. Was it 11 pounds of food? I did a little over 13 pounds of food. Food was fantastic. Definitely recommend coming here. Check them out if you're in the area. Thanks for coming to another video. And thanks, Josh, for, for collabing. Yes, it was great. Thanks for having me. Yeah, check out, again, his link in the description below. See you guys again soon.